Welcome Waffle Warriors, how you been? My name is Waffle Addict, and that is my new intro. Hope you enjoyed it, and um, I'm here to play Keep In Mind Part 2, and I figured out that there was a little counter at the bottom of each message box. I mean, I saw them there before, but I never paid attention to them, so I thought they were just numbers that didn't matter. But I figured out that just counts how many people I've talked to, so I talked to all of the people, and I'm talking to him last. I've talked to all of them before. I know all this. Yes. And now I guess something should happen. Maybe. What was that? My mouse is on the screen. Somebody knocking on my door? Oh god, this is creepy. The creepy ah, it's a mirror. I thought we were about to start a party. What is that? Come on, no jump scares. Oh my. Hello everybody. Those are the 16 people that I was talking to. You not like me? You, you don't like me? I don't think they like me. I am self-denial. I am human you blocked out. Every joy you denied yourself. I am more human than you will ever be. See, I don't know about that. I am panicked. Oh god. No, no, no. I failed him. You failed me. And now we must pay. I don't have any money, so... I am guilt. As am I. I watched the mistake you made over and over. Why am baby crying? And then I watch your brother die before my eyes. I'm guessing I'm insane. I mean, pretty. And I watch you do nothing. And I watch you do nothing. Over and over. Only you can decide to be whole. Well, this is deep. I. I am a pollution. <gasps> Whoa! I'm everything you ran from. Every unpleasant thing shoved back inside. We can't climb my walls. I hope not. I can't find what I've stored in this shelf. But you can. I am. Okay. Cool. I am paranoia. I don't know why. I felt like this is what you would do. There. Did you see them? Every fabricated, <laughs> fabricated lie. They all swarm around my head. Cease. I won't be leaving me. Make them leave, Jonas. I am not Jonas. I am Bob. I am suppression. I taste them and feel you smell them. I feel them. Oh. Okay. I can feel them burning my belly. See, this is really weird. I think I'm dying? Okay. You are killing me, Jonas. Good. I don't want you here. I am decay. I'm waiting for you guys. Okay, that's all you got here. Hmm. Oh, you said something. I am self loaded <laughs> I am the <laughs> that have left me a mangled wretch. You do not deserve to leave this place. Oh, yeah, I do. You got the wrong guy. I'm Bob. I am hopelessness. I am everything you gave up on. I am the lovers you left behind. I am the people you could have been. But now there's nothing left. There's nothing left to do. You must have hope. What? So you're here to help me. I, I am addiction. Oh. Well, what do you mean? I am everything you used to forget. Everything you to pretend to exist. Ah ha ha ha. What have you brought me this time? I, am, I don't know how to pronounce that. Everything you tried to control. Everything that had to be perfect. All I see is chaos. Chaos, 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 chaos. So many flames, too many flames. Only you can put out the flame, James. You, 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 How did I not see that coming? Okay. Chair guy! I am burdened. Each day I work tirelessly. Pretending my worthless existence means something. I carry your world on my shoulders. 
I am so tired. Don't make me stay at all, Jonas. I am Bob. I don't know who this Jonas is you're talking about. I am resignation. <laughs> and every time you've given up, every sadness you couldn't bear, every time you have almost ended everything, I am being sucked away. This can't be the end. Okay. Last one, maybe? No. I regret. Please. Let me get. Open the door, Jonas. I am not Jonas. I am Bob. Okay. Oh. Oh my god. This is brilliant. But where's the last guy? Oh man, look at me. I am gorgeous. So, I finally mustered up something. I skipped it. Just crawl through your filthy mind and find me. Go to bed. You are too. I am you. Don't you know what's going on here? No. Are you too stupid to figure it out? Yeah. Or perhaps you don't want to. You must like squirming in the dark like a man. No! Of course not. Have spent so much time in this place. Whoa! Oh, my place. Oh, this is your house. Don't you realize? These are your thoughts, your memories. Yeah, I realized that a long time ago. Remember I said in the beginning? that this is all in my head your guilt and your obsessions they all hate you they all hate you for what you've done they keep you chained <sighs> that's like the third time I've done that and that's not all is it your brother is dead because actually I have a feeling he's not I feel like you're the one trying to make me think that and I might feel guilty for it but I have a feeling I didn't actually kill him you let him die because you weren't watching. Ooh! Called it! Called it! Soon, your marriage will suffer the same fate. You flounder in your guilt and anger. Well, you seem to be doing the same thing, buddy. You let yourself rot. Mm-hmm. Every chance at life, at life worth living, gone. You're afraid to be alone with your thoughts. Hey, I never said anything about being afraid. I'm not a coward. So you try to tell me. Nature, but what you don't realize, though, those voices that you try to hide the block, they scream more and more loud. Scream until your ears bleed. Okay, so just keep covering your ears, Jonas. Because one day soon, you might sleep so deep, you'll never hear anything again. No. Stop. Stop it. Just shut up. I don't want to hear it anymore. You don't rule me. I don't have to live like this. I don't have to live like you. Oh, good job, Bob. High five. Okay, let's go. There's the last person. Well, 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 can it be? It certainly has been some time. There's no need to be frightened. Either. I knew you were good. Okay. This place is safe, and I am not here to harm you. It's so good to see you again. How does it feel to be back amongst your thoughts? Terrible. This place has changed much in time. As you can see, dear Jonas, the place has gone to the dogs. Uh, okay. Haha. <laughs> <laughs> you remember how it was before the darkness? You remember how it used to be before your brother passed? You were also little, and you used to visit us all the time. We were your best friends. Don't you see, Jonas? We are you. I hope not. That's creepy. We loved you once, and we still do. Aww. But some of us are terribly confused and frightened. That phantom in the mirror who calls himself to you has been keeping you from the truth of these vicious lies. Without you, this darkness. This darkness suffocates us. It has been warped. I said something to you earlier. Ow, my neck was hurting so bad. Okay, something monstrous. 
monstrous. I can't pronounce things tonight, okay? But we are still yours, dear Charles. And we long for the light. That warm light that shone every day. Back when you used to love us. Oh gosh. Now I feel bad. Back when we used back when you used to love me. What are you doing, Doris? I'm just standing with my hands in my pockets. Why is it so dark? You know what you need to do. You need to forgive yourself. You need to forgive yourself for what you've done. And to forgive those that have hurt you. Eh, I don't know that that much. Only then can you live your life fully. Until then, we'll all remain here. Trying to the warmth of the world. Is that my wife? Okay. Do I need to walk around you? Alright, bye. I'm feeling that was probably my brother's voice in my head. Am, am I back home? It doesn't look as though anything's changed. The moon looks so beautiful. Why? I'll try harder and I won't give up. You'll always see the light. Oh, what a sweet ending! Applause! Thanks for playing, goodbye and good luck. Thank you, game developer. You did amazing! Oh. Okay. Um, I'm just gonna play through <laughs> the screen. Um, that game was really, it was really good. I mean, it was, it was really short, but I, I was expecting that. And the characters were so creepy, and the music and the soundtrack went so well with the environment in the game. And the characters were all just, they, they seemed like they were trying to bring me down. But luckily, at the end, I found that phantom person that told me that I shouldn't worry because, you know, life goes on. And it's a very good message that they put in this, and I have no idea how I would be able to explain it to you. But it's a really good message that they put in there, like, even though things seem like they're really bad and they can't get any worse, things always get better, and you will always continue on in life even though you don't think that it's possible. You know, it's, it's a really good message, especially at the end. But in the beginning, I thought it was just going to have, like, a really dark ending, and I was getting prepared for it. But it didn't, it just, um, there's the voices in my head. And I all, I already knew that there were the voices in my head, I figured that at the beginning. But it was still so amazing, I mean, the game design was so simplistic, you wouldn't think that it would be so deep in meaning. And, you know, from the trailer, I thought it was just going to be really, really sad and depressing. But it was really cool, I really liked it. So, if you were like, oh! I almost forgot to mention, in the first episode, I forgot to mention that the game is free to play on Game Built, and I'll leave a, dis a link in the description for you to play it, because it's really good, and I want you all to enjoy it as much as I enjoy it. So if you liked it, slap that like button, you like you really mean it, and subscribe, and I'll see you in Ori in the Blind Forest on Monday. Toodles!